Oh wow. my god. KFC, eat your heart out. Look at this thing. It's amazing. It's piping hot, so make sure you get it and you eat it right away. That sauce is just oozing out of here. Oh, man. That is damn perfect. That is perfect bochi. Like, what are the odds just running into another YouTube? I've been to Tokyo six times now, usually staying about a month. So in this video, I'm going to share with you guys my top 10 favorite foods you must eat here in Tokyo. Number one, sushi zanmai. Upon arrival in Tokyo, my first meal is always a deluxe sushi set at Sushi Zanmai, one of the best sushi chains here in Japan. Top-notch quality at affordable prices. For this video, I visited the original sushi zanmai shop at the Tsukichi Auto Market. That looks amazing. So we got the otoro here, unagi. Starting with otoro, the best piece of the house. Oh man, perfect. It melts on the tip of your tongue. Such a fatty texture. Wow, there's only a few places on the planet where you can get proper sea urchin. Skiji is definitely one of those places. This epic sushi set will set you back 3,000 yen, roughly 27 US dollars. 3,000 yen? Well worth it. Absolutely well worth it. It is a sushi experience you will never forget. Now the most crazy thing about Sushi Zanmai, it is open 24-7. So it doesn't matter what time of the day it is, if you feel like epic sushi, you will be able to get epic sushi. One tip, order the massive Anago. Oh my god, that is huge! <laughs> That is so sweet. Number two, the Uniban from Hamada Shoten. I have to combine my visit to the Tsukichi Auto Market with a delicious Uniman. All right, so now we got here the sea urchin bun, sea urchin bun, which is called Uni. Now, initially I thought the black bun was octopus ink, but it's not. It's bamboo charcoal, very strange combination. So the actual sauce inside is a cream. Oh man. Man, that sauce is just oozing out of here. It's sort of a savory taste, but man, man, that is so good. The bun is quite sticky, so it sticks to your teeth. You can only buy this here at the Tsukichi Outer Fish Market, because the actual fish market closed down. For that, you have to go to Toyasu. It set me back around 860 yen. It's piping hot, so make sure you get it and you eat it right away. Like, don't let it go to waste. The problem with the store is it's open from 5 a.m. to 12 p.m. So you really gotta come here early if you wanna try one of these things. Now, the original Tsukichi fish market moved to Toyosu due to redevelopment. But the Tsukichi outer market is still quite lively, at which you can still run into public tuna cutting in these narrow alleyways. <laughs> Number three, mochi. Top off your tsukichi experience with my favorite Japanese treat, a Japanese mochi ball loaded with custard. Oh, today I'm very lucky. Look what I found. <laughs> custard cream mochi. <laughs> mochi time. Hey. Arigato Oh, man. That is damn perfect. That is perfect mochi. Custard mochi. Just 300 yen. 2 US dollars and 60 cents. Hi, Hi. Above all, I ran into famous YouTuber John Daup from the Only in Japan YouTube channel. Yeah, I don't think anything's really gonna change with the out of market. Who was filming the closure of the Chikichi fish market. Here with <laughs> Only in Japan. <laughs> like, what are the odds just running into another YouTuber? The inner market may have closed down, but the outer market is still very, very lively. Still tons of tourists and locals trying to get their fresh caught of fish. Number four, the best ramen in Tokyo. A solid bowl of ramen in pork broth is also one of the first meals I always get when I visit Tokyo. Jiro Ramen in Shinjuku offers the best bang for your buck. A gigantic bowl of epic pork ramen for just 800 yen, seven US dollars. Serious, serious deals. I mean, look at the size of these ramen. Oishidas. Do tell the chef to hold back on the garlic, it will otherwise be a very stinky aftermath. Number 5. Tsuru Tontan. Another great place for Japanese noodles is Tsuru Tontan, a chain that offers these massive noodle bowls. This place opens at 11am and closes at 8am. 
Yes, 8 a.m. My favorite, these noodles in curry broth for 1890 yen. 17 US dollars. A bit on the pricey side, but a mind blasting dinner experience. I can see it, but oh my god, it could be a family. One of the best noodle bowls restaurants here. It's amazing. Japan is known for their izakayas, Japanese dine and drinking houses, similar to an Irish pub. I recommend izakaya sumire in Shibuya. These tiny dishes at izakayas are for sharing, similar to Spanish tapas. Okay, one of the coolest things this place has to offer with your bags and your luggage right up here. It's just like you're in a train. My favorite izakaya dish is the eihire. Ahihire. Grilled stingray for its crispy outer layer and tough texture on the inside. Often priced at 800 yen, 7 US dollars. Grilled stingray! Alternatively, I also recommend Isakaya Umiya for its Okinawan themed atmosphere. <laughs> Number 7. Sakura, aka raw horse meat. As a Dutchman, I love horse meat. You can order raw horse meat at plenty of isekayas. Namely, Kenchan in Koenji is a great spot. For 800 yen, 7 US dollars, you'll be served a plate with raw slices of delicious, juicy horse meat. Number 8. Yakitori. Another popular inexpensive dish in Japan is yakitori. Yakitori is grilled chicken meat on a stick and can also be found at most isekayas around Tokyo. Or if you're really an adventurous person, you can step it up at Akira, where you can even order raw chicken sashimi. So here we have our rare chicken. I don't know if I should eat it like that. Uh, it's actually pretty good. Check the link in the description box below if you want to see my full review at a raw chicken meat restaurant. Number 9. Fami Chiki. Fami Chiki is my latest snack on my must eat bucket list every time I visit Japan. Fami Chiki is incredibly crispy deep fried chicken that you can buy at the Family Mart convenience store. Just 180 yen, $1.60 US. Apparently, this is the most delicious thing at Family Mart. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> son of a bitch. Oh my god. Bami chicken, that man. That is so good. It's so fresh. It's so juicy. Yes. Boneless chicken. Straight from the fryer. KFC, eat your heart out. Holy moly. If it is a busy day for me in Tokyo, I often find myself getting a quick bite at Matsuya. They sell great bowls of rice and meat. Starting at only 330 yen, $2.70 US. Super cheap, delicious, and filling. Go visit my blog, reformat.com, if you want to download a complete map with all the locations I ate at in this video. So now you know my top 10 favorite foods to eat here in Tokyo and where to get it. Now I would love to know what your favorite foods are in Tokyo. Make sure to leave a comment in the comment section below. Now if you want to watch more of my travel tips for Tokyo, go watch all my previous episodes. And if you like this kind of content, subscribe to my channel and I will see you again in next week's episode. I come by! I come by! <laughs> you don't like uni? Really? How do you like uni? It's like the best thing! I have no idea if this is seafood or a remainder of the dinosaur period. <laughs> it looks ridiculous.